Hello everyone and welcome to today's video. Now today I'm going to be talking about the Valor Patch Notes 7.02 And now uh, this one is not that big other than one thing which is a new esports hub which is very very exciting So let's get right into the Patch Notes and I will first start off with the agent updates It's just voice lines for Jess, so it doesn't really matter But it is esports features and obviously the esports hub is now available uh, Which is basically due to the, the upcoming uh, Valor Champ- uh, well, yeah uh, Valorant Champions in 2023, they've now added a esports sub, which I think will be great for the esports scene as a whole for the game. In between your own matches, you can follow the esports action, get up to speed with all the teams competing, check the schedule, and follow along as your favorite teams make their way through group stages and playoff brackets. The esports sub will be live in game on August 2nd, matches, ki matches kick off on August 6th, and run through, uh, run through the grand finals on August 26th. So. By the time I record is actually it is August second, so it should be live now. So and and people have already looked on what it looks like. It actually looks pretty sleek, I'll be honest. I quite like it. Um from images I've seen, I quite like it. It's very, very cool. Um now player behavior updates. We added party voice mutes for people who have received who have received team voice mutes. Uh we will begin global rollout of our real-time text evaluation and Intervention system up until the uh, up until recently the system which began muting people in voice and text chat who sent disruptive uh, text messages in game was tested in NA regions only. The test run has given us enough confidence to extend the, the coverage to global languages, starting with a mid patch update and continue staggered releases. As we said as we said before, I don't care. It just makes it it's just basically explaining that it's safer and stuff. Uh, bug fixes now. General fixing issue where the sprayer wheel was not was not appearing in team deathmatch and escalation during warmups. Fix the bug where the spike diffuse animation will stop and start while standing on the edge of a site. Uh, fix an issue where you where you were unable to toggle walk if the import settings were set to hold. And fix an issue where the where the duplicate profile button would not gray out after reaching the maximum number of crosshair profiles. Agents, it's quite a lot of them. But it's just oh, so have um, a bug from Omens Shadow, well, Omens from the Shadows, a Shroud of Step, and they were not probably cancelled if they were hit by K zero point or Deadlocks, or Deadlocks, a cocoon. I'm gonna say, uh, fix a knife handle collision on K zero point, um, <laughs> fix Deadlocks Sonic sensor not triggering when when Wingman started diffusing a spike in its area. Uh, fixed Chambers, Rendezvous, not having the correct visuals at his departing location. Uh, fixed Issue, where players trapped by Deadlock's cocoon were not properly killed. Fixed an Issue, where Razor's Showstopper projectile would not explode when hitting players trapped in the cocoon. Fixed an Issue, where damage over time, error abilities like Phoenix Assault Hands would not damage... Sorry, we're not damaging Deadlock's cocoon. Sorry, not cocoon, the Baron Mesh this time. Fix an issue where Brimstone's Orbital Strike did not damage to Cocoon. Uh, fix an issue where Sky would get a, will get an additional charge for of Guiding Light upon swapping sides. Uh, maps fix the bug where going through B side teleport on Vine as a controlled ability, such as Server Aldrum will cut off the teleport sound. Uh, Premiere fix an issue where the Premiere weekly match reset timer was not displaying days until reset. And the known issue is cosmetics, which includes the Araxas skin. The line muzzle flash is currently displaying in black and white for Chromas in third person, which is kind of strange. So that's really all from this video. I will be making a separate video on the champions teams as well currently in World Cup matches. I just have a lot of stuff going on at school, so it's going to be pretty slow. So that's really bad for me. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Catch you guys next time in the next one. Goodbye.